back to Australia. I'm going out back, out back to Australia. See you there. G'day, it's Taro here from Sunland Caravans, and this morning I'm going to show you this brand new van just rolled out of the factory. It's just waiting for Victor and Rosalind to pick up. It's a 20 foot 6 Phoenix in a custom colour called Daintree Green, I think. Anyway, I think it's something like that. Anyway, this one you'll notice that it actually doesn't have a toolbox fitted, so it does look a bit unusual, but Victor's pretty handy and he's going to make his own custom toolbox to fit, to fit on the front of it. So I'll just try and show you a few differences on this van. First one, the standard. The standard with the Phoenix is actually to come with a barbecue, a marine barbecue, but these guys have optioned for the Dometic slide out kitchen. Look how nice and neat these fit. All right, this high quality kitchen comes with a sink and three gas burners. You can actually get a bigger one again if you want to sit a separate barbecue on the outside, but nice and neat. We've got our standard 17 inch wheels and alloy, alloy wheels and tyres. This one actually comes with ATX airbag suspension, which they've optioned up as well as actually getting the um, disc brakes. I'll see if the cameraman can get down on the ground and have a look across the van. And you'll be able to see the ATX have got the beige colored painted arms with piggyback reservoir um, shock absorbers. And then your hydraulic disc brakes to, to match with that. Pretty neat feature. All right, we'll come back up. And you'll see the controls. The controls for the airbag are very similar to the XT controls and we put them in this hatch here. And we've got our auto and manual controls. They also do come with a compressor and a, an airline outlet, so really good for pumping up your tyres if you let them down when you go on corrugations and stuff like that. Move around to the back of the van, and there's not going to be too much different to most of the other things we've done, but you will see they have added the optional ladder. These are handy if you want to get up on the roof and clean your solar panels and, and whatnot. We've got our rear storage hatch here, which is where we fit our instant a gas only hot water system, a Gerard hot water system, at two shore flow water pumps, one for each water tank. The, the standard being 190 general purpose water and 60 for your filtered drinking, as well as a gas heater in this one as well. I don't know if you can see in that film, but there is actually a red water valve there as well, which what that does is it pumps the water back through the system so you don't lose any cold water. Over on this hatch, we've got our power. Okay, so these guys have got two 225 amp hour lithium batteries, uh, which are the standard battery system for this van, uh, built with it, their own individual Anderson plugs that we can program to run an external solar panel, or if you want to run a car fridge or something like that outside the van, it can all be done directly from the battery. And uh, as well as that, it also comes with a 3000 watt inverter. Right, we might head back towards the door of the van. The Phoenix comes standard with a electric awning and at the push of a button, I can open this awning. I'll just demonstrate that. That certainly makes life a lot easier than having to get your awning pole out and try and reach and pull it out. All right, Matt, if you want to come up here, I'll show this. I don't know, most of you probably have seen this, but some of you may not. We actually use a double electric step in all our vans, which is touch button. And you see that tucks back up nice and neat underneath the floor of the van. And we put a mud flap either side of this, because this is an off-road van, and we've got to make sure we've got plenty of stone protection. No step well inside the van. All right, we might have a look inside. So what we're looking at here is the bed end of our 20 foot six Phoenix. This is a full size household queen mattress. So no need for bolsters or anything like that. You will get a standard fitted sheet that will fit on this bed. It's inner spring and pillow top. So quite a nice mattress, but hey, if you don't like it, bring your own mattress and we can fit that too, because it is a full size mattress. These people have optioned to go with CPAP compartments on either side of the van. So basically what we do is create a hole and inside the robe here, we actually have 12 volt and 240 power so you can run your devices or your CPAP machine um, through there. It's a nice little option. You see the overhead cupboards, We're, we've gone with these new concealed hinge, um, latches, so just underneath there, just gives you a nice clean, sleek look. Turning around, this is one that's a little bit different. So these people have opted not to have our standard cafe dining out and gone with a slightly modified version of that. In this one, we've got a permanent table, which is an Evo stone table. And when doing that, we've been able to fit a storage box below this. So if you have a look in under here, 
We've got all that extra storage in this one as well. Sticking with the diamond pattern on the leather, which is standard for the Phoenix and optional in other in our other models. Above table power for your 12 volt and 240 power as well. If it comes through to the bathroom, I might just show you a couple of things in here actually. So we said earlier that this one has got a 3000 watt inverter in it, which of course it does, and that's standard on all our models. In this one, all we need to do to turn the inverter on, just come up into this compartment at the back here, we flip this switch here all the way down to inverter, and turn this one here to inverter, this will power up, and now we're running on battery power. You will hear a few beeps in the van. I can now remotely turn on the air conditioner, and we'll be running our air conditioner off the batteries. This fan's fully charged, you'll probably get several hours out of the full, fully charged batteries um, with aircon. And you probably saw from the earlier photo at the start of the video, on top of this van, we've got four 180 watt solar panels, which will keep those batteries topped up nice and neat, um, nice and well in, in the good weather, um, and, an avail and give you a lot more availability when you go free camping. Okay, so if you like more information on this Phoenix or any of our other Phoenix or other models in the range, uh, please visit us, visit us on our website or our Facebook page or give me a call directly on my mobile or give Roy a call on his mobile. Those numbers will be on the screen right now. And we look forward to talking to you.